Okay, fine. I think we have discussed this or not? We have discussed or not this? Yes, sir. I discussed Karel also. Okay, no problem. Let me discuss one more time. Once more time. So basically, we will divide mechanics of solid in a three part. Okay, so one is a one is a mechanics of rigid body. Second one is the mechanics of deformable body, and third is the mechanics of pull. Now we will not discuss here mechanics of pull because it is a itself a one a subject. Okay, so now we will discuss uh, first of all mechanics of rigid body, and now mechanics of rigid body. One I can tell you, we have already discussed. Okay, uh, I think I have example up in some jalo. If a uh, 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 relative position between two points of the particle remains unchanged before and after application of load, such a body is known as a rigid body. Yes or no? Please confirm me. Okay, definition of yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. So now, no problem. So I think any other divide out. See now again further up a rigid body in a bare part. We divide it. So we have divided rigid body in two part. First is a static, and second is a dynamic. Okay. Now what is the static? Static means your body at a rest condition, and dynamic that means your body in a motion condition. Example of static. Can anyone tell me what is the example of static? We have already discussed yesterday's lecture. Hello, first. एग्जाम्पल ऑफ रीडिंग Uh, one student is student is joining as a name of Galaxy A fifty. Who is who are you? Abhiman, you sir. Uh, please rename yourself. Please, re I am giving. Okay. 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 No problem. Okay. I, I am giving right to name. Okay. Uh, Joe. Uh, please, uh, please remain your yourself. So, no number enough. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay sir. And next lecture, the direct 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 lecture, my name is joining. Oh, the entrance number now is. Ha ha, sir. Done. 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 Then write separate. So that our name change for this piece. Okay, fine. My question is that what is the example of static? It's static that means your body at rest condition. Now give me an example. We have already discussed in yesterday's lecture. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Bolia yes, to? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You can type in chat box also. But I am here to give some example. I am going to discuss here. एग्जाम्पल ठीक है in kinetics we have discussed that motion plus force yes or no motion plus force yes, and kinematics only motion we are not considering any responsible factor which is behind that motion yes or no i hope it is clear to all of you i hope it is clear to all of you theek hai yes kinetics ka example kon dega mere ko chaliye kinetics ka example kon dega sir football ka tumhe je football wala explain kar rahe ho to ye baat बॉडी और एलिमेंट to shape and size change after application of external load is known as a deformable body that's it clear in in case of rigid body relative position between particles remains unchanged 
that means if you are applying the load your body will your body may be change its location for an example if you have mobile phone ठीक है मैं मोबाइल फोन को एक रिजिड बॉडी कंसीडर कर सकता हूं फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल चलो मेरे को ये बताइए कैन आई यस सर यस सर रिजिड बॉडी यस ओके इफ आई एम कंसीडर एन नंबर ऑफ पार्टिकल इन मोबाइल फोन ओके व्हाट एवर लोड विल बी अप्लाई ऑन दिस जस्ट पुट योर मोबाइल फोन इन डैश एंड अप्लाई द लोड ओके एंटी लोड अप्लाई कर दो एक जगह से दूसरी जगह इट विल बी मूव फ्रॉम वन प्लेस टू अनदर प्लेस यस ऑर नो योर मोबाइल फोन विल बी मूव फ्रॉम वन प्लेस टू अनदर प्लेस बट रिलेटिव पोजीशन बिटवीन पार्टिकल्स रिमेंस अनचेंज दैट्स द रीजन इट इज नोन एज अ रिजिड बॉडी एग्री शो यस सर यस सर ठीक है चलो डिफोनल बॉडी में क्या बोल रहे अ बॉडी और एलिमेंट हुज शेप एंड साइज चेंज आफ्टर एप्लीकेशन ऑफ एक्सटर्नल लोड इज नोन एज अ डिफॉर्मेबल बॉडी नाउ just just take a example of sponge can i say that sponge is a example of deformable body if i am applying the load on sponge sofa ma je tamara ghar ma je sofa hoy che clear ema je sponge use thai che ani baat karu chu any for load apply karis so it will be it will be compressed yes or no yes or no yes sir yes sir deformable body can can a body no shape and size change thai che yes or no ठीक है चलो जनरली ऑल द बॉडीज आर डिफॉर्मेबल नाउ टू स्मॉलर और ग्रेटर एक्सटेंट नाउ आइडियली वी कांट से आइडियली वी कांट से एवरी बॉडी इज अ रिजिड बॉडी आइडियल कंडीशन में रिजिड बॉडी होवी पॉसिबल नथिंग कैम डिपेंडिंग ऑन व्हिच एक्सटेंट ऑफ द लोड आर यू अप्लाई इफ देयर इज अ लोड कैरी सपोज फॉर एन एग्जांपल आई एम गिविंग अ लिटिल बिट मोर लोड विद अ हैमर ऑन मोबाइल सो इट विल बी इट वुड बी डैमेज यस ऑर नो It will yes, be damaged. Yes. Or yes. Okay. So depending on which intensity of load you will be applied, ah, uh, uske upar depend hai apka body rigid hai ya different. But ideally, no body is rigid. Okay. Ideal case mein hum kisi bhi body ko rigid nahi bol sakte. Okay. Because it is the ideal as as in some means actual life mein koi bhi body rigid nahi. ठीक है? Is it clear something about introduction? Yes, sure. sir. Sure. Abu kya hai? बराबर पूछा है याद है बराबर जो ही एक बे लेक्चर थोड़ा बोरिंग डेफिनेशन स्पर्श आए ओके देन आफ्टर वी विल मूव टू द न्यूमेरिकल पोर्शन नाउ स्पेस फर्स्ट डेफिनेशन इज अ स्पेस बिफोर स्टार्टिंग इट लेट्स बी डिस्कस सिस्टम ऑफ यूनिट आई थिंक यू ऑल आर वेर अबाउट दिस सिस्टम ऑफ यूनिट यसो नो यसो नो एस सीजीएस एम के एस एंड एच एस आई क्लियर लेंथ एफपीएस में फुट फुट में मेजर कर सीजीएस में सेंटीमीटर एमकेएस में मीटर एसआई में मीटर मास एफपीएस में पाउंड सीजीएस में ग्राम एमकेएस में किलोग्राम एसआई में किलोग्राम टाइम बताओ सेकंड ऑफ सेकंड ओके आई थिंक इट इज क्लियर टू नेक्स्ट स्पेस स्पेस इज अ रीजन इन ऑल डायरेक्शन एंड कंटेन विद इन एवरीथिंग इट ओके स्पेस इज अ वन रीजन इन ऑल डायरेक्शन and contain everything within it for an example if i am consider sun and star so can i say that sun has a system or space in other word it is defined as unlimited expanse of the physical dimension in which all the material objects are located so can i say that earth is the one kind of space yes or no yes in in which everything will be covered In which everything will be covered. But agree, you cover pretty. Can I pretty? Yes, sir. Please confirm here. Yeah? Are you getting my point? Now, but now, but put that here. Fine. Come on. Next is a time. It is a measure of duration between successive events. कोई समझे सकते व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ दिस स्टेटमेंट इट इज अ मेजर ऑफ ड्यूरेशन बिटवीन सक्सेसिव इवेंट्स कैन एनीवन एबल टू एक्सप्लेन दिस स्टेटमेंट सर कोई भी बे इवेंट थाया एनी बच्चे जे यस डिफरेंस हतो एने कही सके फॉर एन एग्जांपल तुम्हें क्लासरूम में बैठा जो इमेज इमेजिंग करो बराबर दैट इज द इवेंट नंबर ए कही सके हम क्लासरूम मध्य कैंटीन गया कैंटीन में बैठा डेट इज इवेंट नंबर टू यस सर एनी बच्चे जब हमारे समय लग रहे हैं इतना टाइम इस क्लियर यस फाइन चलो नेक्स्ट मैटर एनी सब्सटेंस 
which occupies space that is called matter in other word it is defined as a substance that possesses a weight occupies space and that can be apprehended by sense that means we can see by eye it can be having a some space so you can say your pen is a one kind of the matter can i say that your pen is a one kind of matter because it, it having a some space a making space available so barabar na yes sir for an example if you are considering the four wheeler okay gaadi car ni baat kare to any and the seat che that is called matter yes or no enu kai weight hase ena apne aap ki jo eyes thi joi sakisu we can visualize with eye okay yes or no yes sir now what is the body what is definition interrelated jo any matter that is bounded by a closed surface that is called body and it is a portion of matter which which is limited in every direction the body is considered as accumulation of large number of particle and body is formed by surfaces example car kai sakta there is a number of elements or number of matters in a number of matters in a car if i am bounded there that, that number of matter can i say that it is a body a agree so please yes sir me. yes sir uh, now one one more question to all of you is there any language confusion koi na gujarati ma khabar na padti ho to એવો કોઈ પ્રોબ્લેમ છે કોઈ ને ક્વિક ક્વિક ગેમિંગ ઇન્ફોર્મેશન નો સર નો સર ઇફ એની સ્ટુડન્ટ જસ્ટ મિનિટ ઇફ એની સ્ટુડન્ટ હેવિંગ અ પ્રોબ્લેમ વિથ લેંગ્વેજ ઓકે હી ઓર સી કેન આસ્ક ઇન અ ક્વેશ્ચન ઇન અ ચેટ બોક્સ ઓકે મે ચેટ બોક્સ જોડે ઓપન રાખેલું છે ડોન્ટ વરી એવરી ચેટ વિલ બી વિઝિબલ બાય મી ઓન મારા સિવાય કોઈ ચેટ નહીં જોઈ શકે ઠીક છે so if you have any question you can ask the uh, question in chat box just a minute just a minute just a minute hold is my voice is clear yes yes sir okay fine so now second thing is that we are learning the online yes or no yes yes so please yes sir please, please remain active during the lecture okay how mu tumna koi bhi question puchu eno answer chat box ma lo બરાબર તો મને પણ ખબર પડશે કે તમને ખબર પડે છે ઓકે નાઉ ધીસ લેક્ચર્સ આર થિયોરિટિકલ લેક્ચર ફર્સ્ટ ટુ ઓર થ્રી લેક્ચર્સ આર થિયોરિટિકલ લેક્ચર ઓકે ધેન આફ્ટર વી આર શિફ્ટિંગ ટુ ન્યુમેરિકલ પોર્શન્સ બહુ બધા ન્યુમેરિકલ્સ ગણવાના આવશે બરાબર એમાં તમારે કેલ્ક્યુલેટર લઈને બેસવાનું છે ઓકે લેક્ચરમાં કેલ્ક્યુલેટર લઈને બેસવાનું ઇન માય લેક્ચર્સ ડ્યુરિંગ લેક્ચર નો નીડ ટુ રાઈટ એનીથિંગ મારે હું અહીંયા લખીશ તમને બધું દેખાશે ઓકે જે રીતે બ્લેકબોર્ડ પર ભણતા હશે એવું જ તમને દેખાશે ક્લિયર છે તમારે જસ્ટ આન્સર આપવાનો છે ઓકે હું તમને રેકોર્ડિંગ રેકોર્ડિંગ એક બે દિવસમાં એક ગૂગલ ક્લાસરૂમ બનાવીશ એમાં તમારે જોઈન થવાનું છે એમાં એક ગૂગલ ફોર્મ શેર કરીશ એમાં એમાં તમારે તમારું ઈમેલ આઈડી નાખી દેવાનું છે બરાબર અને ગૂગલ ડ્રાઈવમાં તમને બધા રેકોર્ડિંગ શેર કરો ઓકે સો યુ કેન સી દેટ રેકોર્ડિંગ ફોર યોર ટાઈમ અને એના ઉપરથી નોટ્સ તમે પછી બનાવો દેટ્સ ક્લિયર સો અમારે હમણાં તમારે જે પિસ્તાલીસ મિનિટનો લેખ્યો છે એમાં શાંતિ સમજવાનું છે આપણે શું સ્ટડી કરીએ છીએ ઠીક છે પણ જયારે પણ ન્યુમેરિકલ પોર્શન ચાલતો હશે ત્યારે પ્લીઝ એક્ટિવ કેમ કે જો કેલ્ક્યુલેટર યુઝ નહીં કરો તો નહીં આવે ક્લિયર છે ઇનર્શિયા ઇટ ઇઝ અ પ્રોપર્ટી બાય વર્ચ્યુ વિચ બોડી ઓફર રેજિસ્ટન્સ ટુ એની ચેન્જ ઓફ ઇટ સ્ટેટ ઓફ રેસ્ટ ફોર મોશન નાઉ કેન એની વન એબલ ટુ એક્સપ્લેન ધીસ સ્ટેટમેન્ટ ઇટ ઇઝ અ વેરી ઇમ્પોર્ટન્ટ એન્ડ વી ઓલ આર વી ઓલ આર observe such kind of situation in our routine life also sir yes bike no tire ho ena upar je sir grip hoy jara apne apie te full friction to aape matlab sir road par ne friction is a different and friction is a difference different and inertia is a difference okay 
બસ માં ક્યારે ટ્રાવેલ કરેલું છે ઉભા ઉભા બેસીન નહી ઓકે નાઉ અગેન વેનેવર યોર ધેટ ફોર્સ ઇઝ એક્સેસ ઇનર્શિયા ફોર્સ યસ ડેફિનેટલી વી વિલ ફોલ ડાઉન બરાબર ડેફિનેટલી વી વિલ ફોલ ડાઉન બટ ઇફ વી ઇફ ધેટ ફોર્સ ઇઝ વિથ ઇન અ રેન્જ યોર બોડી ઇઝ ઓપર રેજિસ્ટન્સ નાઉ અહીંયા સોરો કે જે ઇસ ચેન્જ ઓફ ઇસ સ્ટેટ ઓફ રેસ્ટ તમે ઇનિશિયલ તો રેસ્ટ કન્ડિશન માં હતા નો સ્ટેડી ઉભા હતા પણ પછી મોશન માં આયા આગળ આગળ ની ડાયરેક્શન માં યસ ઓર નો મેજર of inertia inertia ka quantitative measure hai in other word it is defined as the quantitative measure of resistance offered by any substance to change its position clear so uh hu be body lai lau chu be body lai lau chu one is one is your uh, uh, just a minute i am taking a two block i am taking a two block one is made of the steel and another block is made of the રેજિસ્ટિંગ કેપેસિટી ક્વોન્ટિટેટિવ મેઝર છે ખબર પડી ક્યારે with respect to that reference point your body will remain in a same condition okay with a different interval of time so in that case we can say that your body in a rest condition is it clear please confirm me is it clear yes sir yes so body motion ma kya kehvai a body is motion body is said to be in motion if it changes position with respect to reference point at a different interval of time for an example car is moving on road yes or no car jo uh, if if any car is moving on road it will be change its uh, location with respect to time and with respect to that location your uh, distance between a uh, uh, particular uh, with respect to reference point also will be change yes or no for an example yes sir for an example you are, you are driving your bike on road from sal okay તો તમે અલગ 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 લોકેશન પર જશો તો તમારું ડિસ્ટન્સ બદલાઈ જશે વિથ રિસ્પેક્ટ ટુ ટાઈમ જશો નો ધેટ્સ ધ એક્ઝામ્પલ ઓફ મોશન આઈ એન્ડ વી હેવ ઓલરેડી ડિસ્કસ રિજિડ બોડી એન્ડ ડિફોર્મેબલ બોડી અહીંયા સુધી કોઈ ડાઉટ છે અહીંયા સુધી કોઈ ડાઉટ છે પ્લીઝ ગીવ મી ક્વિક ચેક ઇઝ ઇટ ક્લિયર હા સર ફાઈન ચલો નેક્સ્ટ ફંડામેન્ટલ પ્રિન્સિપલ ઓફ મિકેનિક્સ 
ભણી ગયા છો ને ફોર્સ it will change in state of rest or motion is it clear this is the newton's first law every body continues state of rest or motion when it is acted upon by some external agency so this is the newton's first law clear chalo newton's second law is most important can anyone tell me what is a newton's second law tumhe su bhaniya cho newton's second law ma okay no problem gujarati ma fine vedan what is your question you can ask me now સર આ ડેફિનેશન માં થોડું ગુજરાતી માં ટ્રાન્સલેશન ટ્રાન્સલેશન કર દો બરાબર છે ડેફિનેશન તો અંગ્રેજી માં જ લખવું પડશે અને આ તો લો છે બરાબર આ તો લોસ છે એટલે આમાં આમાં કોઈ આમાં આમાં તો હું શું ટ્રાન્સલેશન કરું આમાં ની ઉપર જે હતી ભાઈ સોરી વિચ વન પ્લીઝ પ્લીઝ મેન્શન નેમ ડિફોર્મેબલ બોડી ખબર પડી કે ના પડી ક્લિયર પ્રેશર આપો એટલે થઈ એટલે તમારી બોડી નો શેપ અને સાઇઝ ચેન્જ થશે ધેટ ઇઝ નથિંગ બટ યોર ડિફરન્ટ બોડી ડન ઓકે ક્વેશ્ચન કુતરા રહેજો નો પ્રોબ્લેમ ઓકે ઇટ્સ ગુડ ચલો નેક્સ્ટ ન્યુટન સેકન્ડ લો કેન એનીવન ટેલ મી વોટ ઇઝ ન્યુટન સેકન્ડ લો વોટ ઇઝ ન્યુટન સેકન્ડ લો f is equal to ma મોમેન્ટમ ઇઝ પ્રપોર્શનલ ટુ for your force is directly proportional to rate of change of momentum yes or no how can you do as per this statement yes or no please confirm me yes okay so can we say that your force is directly proportional to rate of change of momentum at physics level momentum bani ga so momentum momentum equals to mass into velocity yes or no momentum equal to mass into velocity agree chu bada સકાય yes so can i say it m into a so now can i can i write like that f is proportional to m into a yes or no yes cover padi ke na padi cover padi ke na padi so now tumhe actually je now again mass is a constant barabar mass is a constant so jare pan u jare pan u proportional limit chodi so constant term rahe se mass into a 
So actually, the matter is the F is proportional to acceleration. Yes or no? Yes. Yeah, I'm here. How about buddy? Derive by the F equals to MA. Please confirm. Is it clear or not? Yes, sir. So from this, can I say that Newton's second law will give a definition of force? What's the definition of force? Yes, sir. So just read statement carefully. Just read a statement carefully. It states that rate of change of momentum of body is directly proportional to impressed force. And it takes place in direction of the force acting on it. That means J direction ma load lag, say direction ma J actors. Thus, according to law, we can say that force is directly proportional to rate of change of momentum. But momentum is equal to mass into velocity. Just put that terminology in above equation. So can I say that force, force is directly proportional to mass into rate of change of velocity because mass is your constant term. That's the reason we will put it sir, outside the derivative. So can I say that mass is direct, oh, sorry, force is directly proportional to mass into acceleration. F, F directly proportional to mass into acceleration. Mass is a constant. That's why I am removing it. So I am, I am writing like that. F is proportional to acceleration. And I'm going to proportionality limit remove for you. I'm going to constant move over that constant is nothing but your mass. Clear, sir? Please confirm me. Clear, sir? Yes. This explanation yes. is fine. fine. Next. Newton's third law. Calcium. Newton's first law. On yes. To every action, there is equal reaction, equal and opposite reaction. Tame same coin lapo marsu, tame same lapo person. Barabar. Agree, sir? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, nice. Same order. Ponche Juan, Pachi, yes, sir. Barabar. That means, that means uh, to every action there is a equal and opposite reaction. Same point that you want to achieve yes. Clear? Please confirm me. Newton has thrown low clear. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, fine. Chalo. Next, I think the scalar quantity and a vector quantity is so physics level. Can anyone tell me what is scalar quantity? Chalo, Koi scalar quantity is so physics level. Sir, only direction. Vicharo, Vicharo. Scalar kaucho. Sir, only magnitude. Magnitude. Koi quantity that ma define karu hua. It is required only magnitude. Such a quantity is known as a scalar. If any quantity is required, if any quantity is a required direction as well as uh, magnitude, okay? And such a quantity is known as a vector. Okay, and examples. Scalar my example, length, area, time, mass. Is a fact. Length, area, time, mass. And a vector, uh, vector my example, force, velocity, acceleration, weight. Clear, sir, please confirm me, students. Yes, sir. So this is your something about introduction. It is complete. Any other question? Is there any question? No, sir. No, sir. Let me start next topic. Force and its characteristics most important. Amati, Karmic theory, Puchach. Define force. What is force? Force is an agency that change or tend to change. Change Korea and another change around try Okay. That is your tends to change the state of rest or uniform motion of body. Okay. Suppose the body body rest condition mass, so rest mass in motion. Suppose the body body uniform uniformly motion cut the asset, then emotion disturb person. Is it clear? Is it clear? Uniform motion of matlab cover the queen. What is uniform motion? Force distribution is equal. 
Okay. Uh, unit of the force is a kilonewton or newton. Clear now. Next is important point. Class test. Okay, and after next lecture on force. Okay, can can my explanation for you? Other things. Any other thing you want to doubt? Check students. No, sir. Okay. 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 थोड़ा डिटेल में समझो सर तो थोड़ा टाइम लेस है तो नेक्स्ट लेक्चर में यहाँ से स्टार्ट करते हैं जस्ट मिड आई एम टेकिंग योर अटेंडेंस पूछी सको कैमरा चालू करो कौन कौन से जो करो बेसिकली 